Hello students of class 8. Welcome to the online tutorial classes for Vidya Bhavan High Secondary School. And this video is for class 8 biology. And the chapter what I will continue today is the health and hygiene. And this video is part 8. Okay. So, in the previous videos, I have discussed about the vectors, pathogens, disease and their effects and the symptoms. Today, I will continue with it. Okay. So, for today, the first disease vector is Culex mosquito. Till now, we are talking about the Aedes mosquito. But today, now, we have the Culex mosquito. So, what is the name? Culex. What is the name of the pathogen? It is Ucheraria bancrofti. Okay. Please remind the spelling. Please go through the spelling and please remind them in your examination because if you are incorrect with your spelling, then the marks will be deducted. Okay. Ucheraria. Bancrofti. It is the name of the pathogen and it is actually one worm or round worm. Okay. And the disease caused by Ucheraria bancrofti, or which the vector is Culex mosquito, the disease is Filariasis. Pineriasis. Okay, it is the name of this disease. Now, what are the effects and the symptoms of this Ucheraria bancrofti pathogen by this pathogen disease Pineriasis is mainly the thickening of the skin. Okay, so what is the first effect? Thickening of skin and swelling of the arms and legs by the water retention. Our arms and the legs are became broad, became swollen during the uh, during this disease due to the water retention, excessive water retention. Next one is swelling of arms, legs, genitalia, genitalia, these are the main parts where the swelling can be seen, due to retention of fluid in tissues. So this is the main symptoms. These are kind of the new symptoms which you can see in the disease of the filariasis. The next disease is plague. And it is caused by rat plague. And the pathogen is named. Yersinia pastries. Okay. It is actually a bacteria. Next, the name of the disease is plague. Okay. The effects, effects, the main vector is rat. So, by the rat, the disease can be spread. The disease name is plague. Is swallowing of painful lymph nodes and groins. What are the effects of it? Painful lymph nodes in groins, neck or armpit. And next, one more common 
common symptoms that can be seen in this disease is the fever along with the chill. Okay. So the fever and chills also headache. It is a disease, it's a very old disease actually. The next disease is or is the saliva of the infected animal like the dogs and the disease is called the rabies. Okay, so I am just erasing this part and I will write the part here. So I am just, I am erasing this phyloriasis. Okay. So now the vector is dogs. It is now one vector which is a mammal. Okay, so the mammal bone disease, mammal vector bone disease, saliva of infected animal, mainly dogs. The pathogen is Rhabdovirus, which is as the name suggests, it is a virus, and the disease name is rabies. Okay, or hydrophobia. It is a very interesting disease where the persons having rabies have the Phobia in seeing this water, anything, anything in water, like the water bodies, everything. Whenever they see the water, they are getting uh, very frightened about that. Okay. The effects are, it attacks the nervous system. It is the first effect. The next one, it is, it can be lead to mental depression. Okay. So the person can get mentally depressed during this disease. The next, convulsion can also be seen. So it is actually a very dangerous disease. Okay. The next is spasms and it can be lead to the paralysis too. So actually when the dogs bite, uh, the person have the dog bites and the dog person have the disease like rabies, the injections, they have to take the proper injections just to be cured from this disease. So till, till this, the vector part are been completed. The vector bone diseases are being completed. So in the next video, we will talk about the prevention of this disease. Till then, thank you.